Nikki's twin sister Brie Bella previously shared that their mother's recovery process will be about six months to a year. Nikki Bella's mother is on the road to recovery after undergoing brain surgery late last month. The pregnant Total Bella's star, 36, shared a health update with her followers on Thursday, detailing all of the improvements mom Kathy Colace Laurinaitis has been making. Have had two amazing visits with my mom her balance and walking has gotten better. Her speech has gotten better. Even though her face hasn't yet, with all of your love, support and prayers you have given her so much hope and strength to have a full recovery. She wrote alongside a family photo of herself, twin sister Brie Bella and their mother, with covering over one of her eyes. Gigi you got this. We love you so incredibly much. She added using an affectionate nickname for her mother. Sharing the same photo, Kathy noted how much the support of her two daughters has meant to her. Sitting here with my girls appreciating all the love and support I have received from my husband, my family, my friends, the Bella Army and the doctors at Mayo, she wrote, adding that although the road ahead of me will be challenging, all of the love and prayer she's received gives me the strength and hope to have a full recovery. Love you all. And thank you all so much. God bless. Nikki and Brie first revealed that their mother would be undergoing surgery last month, explaining that doctors had discovered a mass on her brain stem. While the surgery was successful, Kathy's recovery process will be about six months to a year, Brie, who is also expecting her second child, said on Wednesday's episode of The Bella's Podcast. Earlier in the episode, Bree said their mother was initially diagnosed with Bell's palsy four months ago, explaining that the majority of her face was paralyzed, it was her left side. You saw it a lot in her eye and her mouth and her forehead. A couple of weeks ago, Kathy's condition worsened, and Bree said she woke up to her whole face being numb. Kathy's husband, John Laurinaitis, took her to the hospital, where doctors discovered that there was a moss on our mother's brain stem as big as a blueberry. Kathy's diagnosis was also captured on camera. My mom really wanted the cameras to roll because, obviously, we were all like, no. But my mom's like, think of how many people out there think they have Bell's palsy, or they have certain symptoms and the doctors don't give them MRIs on their brain? And then, they find out they have these growths or tumors or cancer and it's so late in the game, Nikki added. Although their mother is just at the start of her recovery. Her daughters feel fortunate that she's on the right track. It's been so nice just to like see our mom be our mom again, Bree said during the podcast episode, adding that Kathy is still very beat up. We're just so happy that she has light at the end of the tunnel, she said. Mm -hmm.